Hey everyone, this is Renee from iMore.com and we're going to take a quick look at shortcuts for the home screen and the keyboard on the new iPad. Using the keyboard with your iPad. If you want to enter text, you just tap somewhere, the keyboard will come up. You can put it away and bring it up just by tapping anywhere that there is text. It's very simple to start writing. You might notice that there is a number key to switch between letters and numbers and a symbol key to switch between numbers and symbols. If you want to enter a large series of numbers, just hit the number button, start typing, hit the ABC button and go back to your letters. If you just want to enter one quickly, tap, hold down, go to the number, let go. It's faster. Same with capitals. If you want to Enter a capital, you tap the shift button, type your letter. You can also touch and hold, go to your letter and let go. To caps lock, you tap twice, it turns blue, and then everything you type will be capitalized. If you want to get a list of alternate characters, for example, the letter E will put up all sorts of international E's. Any character that has a variety of choices with it will put up those characters. If a character only has one simple choice, for example, the exclamation point comma also has the apostrophe, you can simply tap and swipe up and it will enter it much more quickly. Same thing with the question mark, tap and swipe up to get the quote. There are also a couple time-saving tips. If you're typing large amounts of text, double tapping will automatically insert a period after what you've written. Also, to save yourself some effort typing contractions, you can very easily just double up on, on the last character and it will suggest the proper contraction and you can just keep typing. Um, if you prefer not to type with a laptop style keyboard, but you can tap the dock button and go up to split, to split your keyboard. You can also tap and hold it and merge it back together again. A faster way is to simply put two fingers on and pinch it apart and you can do that with the regular keyboard as well. It also includes voice dictation so you can just tap the microphone button, start talking and it will write down everything that you say. Period. New paragraph. Isn't that amazing? Period. New paragraph. Open parentheses. It really really is. Exclamation point. Close parentheses. And if anything is ever incorrect, it's underlined in blue. You just tap it and it will give you alternative options. If you ever make a mistake, you can just hold your device, shake it, and you will get to undo whatever the last thing you did was.